Hey, what's up? This is Leo from the Leo Experience, and in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to airstrike mission 10 Angel with Broken Wings from Metal Gear Solid 5, the Phantom Pain, the easiest and fastest way possible. So, the first thing you want to do is start the mission and select this landing zone right here. There are two other landing zones, but you don't need to pick them since they're like dangerous. So, just pick this one right here. So, once you pick this landing zone, it's going to take you to the briefing um, briefing menu. Uh, you don't need anything for this mission. I have the MRS-4 rank 1. Um, you won't need it though. And I have the, my tranquilizer pistol rank 1 too. You won't need it either. But the main thing you'll need for this mission is C4. Even if it's rank 1, level 1. Um, you're still going to need it. <clears throat> to take out a tank. But that's pretty much it. So make sure you have at least rank 1 C4 for this mission. So now all you want to do is start the mission. And when you start the mission, choose 1800. So you can start it at night time. And let's get started. is to rescue a prisoner being held at Lamar Khatib Palace. He's known as Malak, angel to his fellow Mujahideen. Start by checking the target's VI on your iDroid. The Soviets captured him and took him to the ruins of the palace. His family was subsequently killed in an airstrike on his village. The Soviet scorched earth operation wiped it off the map. The client is none other than his father. Or rather, this was his father's dying wish. To rescue other prisoners as well. Each one will add a bonus to our pay. When you see them, I'm sure your conscience will tell you what to do. Alright, so when you get off the uh, helicopter, just get on D horse. And all you want to do for now is just keep going straight. Um, stay close to the mountain to the left as it's going to take you straight to where you need to go so just keep going straight through here if you take the right path you should see some little roadblocks and this tank to the left now you just need to mark um, the second guy with the spotlight right there there's one and there's two just you know mark the second one so all you want to do now is go through here you want to go around to this area and get off when you see like a little path to the right so if you do it, redoing this mission and you're um, a high rank you know there, there's gonna be a balloon right there uh, it might be a soldier so mark him first just to make sure now for for sure there's gonna be a soldier here just lay down and crawl up to him and knock him down with the CQC button and hold him up by aiming your weapon at him so what you want to do from now is equip your C4 and you want to lay down and roll to the tank you want to roll because it's faster than crawling and you won't get spotted so now just mark the prisoner and put four c4s on the tank so right here you want to you want to pay attention when that car reaches the light right there that light post you want to blow up the c4 once you blow it up look to your right and when the soldier runs you want to run too just run over to this tree right here Alright, so once you're at this tree, make sure that the guards um, walk away far enough from the car. So now just call your helicopter to this landing zone right here. And call your helicopter. All you want to do from here is just get in the car and go off-road to the right. So just drive the car to the landing zone. Don't, you know, go over any cliffs or anything since he might fall off and die since he's wounded and just be careful uh, once you get to the landing zone don't park too close to it park like um, a couple meters away from it since Pico is gonna ask you to move the car if it's you know too close to the landing zone so just get the prisoner and just all you need to do from from, from here on is you know wait for the helicopter and once you um, once the helicopter gets here, all you need to do is, uh, is get on the helicopter, and that's it for this mission. It's an easy S rank. 
And just follow all these steps and you should be fine. You shouldn't get spotted or anything. So once your helicopter lands, just get in with the prisoner and that's it. Easy S rank. And that's pretty much it for this mission. The only um, times you may get spotted is if you crouch too late when you um, roll into the tank. Just roll to the tank. Um, and when the tank blows up, make sure the, the soldier behind you runs away so he doesn't spot you running. Because if you run too early, he's going to spot you. And he's going to go into reflex mode and you might miss the shot. So those are the only two um, possible ways that you might get spotted. So uh, just be careful and follow these steps. If you like the video, leave a like. And also share with your friends so they can know how to get this S rank if they need it too. That's pretty much for this video. If you're new, subscribe to my YouTube channel for daily videos on GTA 5, Metal Gear, and other games. And also live streams. And I'll see you guys in the next video.